here if you haven't done so already make sure you do the right thing and hit the subscribe button below and if you enjoyed the video then give your girl a thumbs up all right so let's get it i have here this box it has a just do the tape on the top lid someone in my comments previously called it the just steal me tape which i thought was really funny um so let's crack it open all right so here you have the box nike with a swoosh on the top lid so let's take a look inside This is the Notre Nike Dunk High in the Midnight Navy colorway, and these are so fire. I'm a huge fan of it. I think it's super fresh. I like how there's different shades of blue throughout the shoe, and there's some splash of a sail color just to give it a nice contrast. So Notre is a Chicago-based retailer, and Chicago is my favorite city to visit in the United States, so I can't wait to go back when it's safer to travel. And so I love the food and the people. It's super diverse out there, so I always have a great time. So I can't wait to visit and check out their boutique. So these are super dope. This is one of two different colorways that dropped um, between Notra and Nike. So the other one is an Orwood brown color and this is the second colorway. So let's go to some details. This shoe was inspired by classic workwear or uniform from the color palette to the different features on the shoe, as well as the materials that are used and how they're applied are all centered around that theme. So for the front toe cap, the eye stays, the heel and the ankle collar that overlays the swoosh on the lateral side, it's all made of a suede material that's super shaggy. So I feel like the more you rock them or the more that they're distressed, the better it'll look. For the toe box as well as the panels behind the swoosh and the collar is in the sky gray color and what's really dope is that on the lateral side it's made out of leather whereas on the medial side it's made out of canvas instead. Some other differences between the lateral and the medial side of the shoe is for the unibody piece that I referenced earlier that overlays the swoosh on the lateral side, on the medial side it has an opposite effect and this swoosh here is stitched on instead and it's in that midnight navy color and it's really dope because there's a hand licking swoosh here, which is Notre's motif because it's supposed to bring out that sense of togetherness because the word Notre means ours in French. So I thought it was really cool that they're able to highlight that in the shoe here. So a lot of different materials going on here. So let's take a look at the right shoe. shoe and as I was taking it out of the box I was like why is this shoe slightly heavier than the left shoe and my arms are super weak so I'm really sensitive to these things and so I looked inside and I saw that there were extra set of laces tucked in so that explains it I didn't just get like weaker over the time of the review or anything like that so this shoe comes with three sets of laces the first one is pre-laced on these are flat white laces with some navy blue woven into it this one here is a sail colored lace these are round laces and then the third one is a burlap colored lace. Um, this is a different type of weaving pattern compared to the other two, so really interesting. So if you want to swoosh it up and swap them out, you can. On the back of the shoe between the tail end of the swoosh and the top of the heel, there's a sail colored netting and it overlays a 3M reflector panel. So on this pull tab, there's a very similar feature. So instead of a sail color, it's midnight navy and there's a 3M reflector pull tab. And then right below it, there's some leather going on there as well. For this midsole here, it's in sale, and earlier I talked about how it complements the shoe really well because if they were to use a really bright white color, it just would clash with the shoe. And I think it's going for that vintage look, so it works really well with these shoes. For the inside of the shoe, this lining is made out of leather and it's in that midnight navy color, and the same color is applied to the insole as well, and there's a Nike with a swoosh imprinted in white. However, for the insole, it looks like there's some treatment done to it to give it that rugged, distressed look. 
And to me, it looks like there's some old glue dried up in there, so it's really interesting. For the tongue of the shoe, it's super dope because it ties in different materials that I use on the shoe. So for the top layer, it's made out of canvas, and then the middle layer is made out of suede, and then on the back side of the tongue is made out of leather. For the sky gray tongue tab here, Nike with the swoosh is in midnight navy, and the same thing goes for the left shoe. However, what's super dope is that on the left shoe, there's also this patch here. So very similar to a workman uniform where they have their name patch on their left side, this one has it on the left shoe. So this is a Notre name tag that's embroidered on in white in a script font on top of a midnight navy patch with a white border. Down here for your midnight navy also, this is your classic dunk silhouette. And I think that they should have treated it to make it look more vintage or distressed. So very similar to what they did with the insoles, right? So might as well just complete the look. But that's just my opinion. So I like these shoes a lot. I think the colorway is super dope. And I talked about it previously, how I love it when stores and boutiques and retailers collaborate with Nike to design their own shoe because they put in so much thought and detail behind the design and the craftsmanship on the shoe is incredible and I like the inspiration behind it as well. So this is Notra's first collaboration with Nike and I hope it's not their last and I'm super bummed because I hit on a men's size and not my size instead. So if anyone out there has a size 4 and want to do a size swap, holla at your girl. I'll throw in like an extra limited edition Hennessy bottle or something. So if you ever get your hands on these or your feet in them, make sure you go to the size and thanks for tuning in.